In this lesson, we're going to focus on addition, adding two large numbers together, particularly long addition. So let's say if we want to add 43 and 26 together, how can we do that? Well, what we need to do is we need to line them up like this. Once we do that, we simply need to add each column of numbers. So starting from the right, let's add the first column of numbers. 3 plus 6 is 9. Now let's move on to the second column. 4 plus 2 is 6. So the answer is 69. That's 43 plus 26. It equals 69. Now for the sake of practice, go ahead and try these two examples. 24 plus 53 and also 42 plus 36. So starting with the first example, 24 plus 53. Starting from the right, if we add the first column of numbers, 4 plus 3 is 7. And then if we add the second column of numbers, 2 plus 5 is 7. So 24 plus 53 is equal to 77. Now let's move on to the next example. 42 plus 36. 2 plus 6 is 8. 4 plus 3 is 7. And this gives us 78. Now, let's try a similar but slightly different example. So let's say we want to add 45 and 38. Go ahead and try that example. Feel free to pause the video as you work on this problem. So starting with the first column on the right, 5 plus 8 is 13. Now this is a number that's bigger than 9. So when you get a result of 10 or more, in this case, 13, we're going to write the 3 and we're going to carry the 1. The 1 is going to go here in the second column. So now we have three numbers to add in the second column. 1 plus 4 is 5. 5 plus 3 is 8. So the final answer is 83. Now let's try some more examples similar to that. So let's add 54 and 29. Also 146 and 75. Go ahead and try those two problems. So starting with the first one, 54 plus 29. Four plus 9 is 13. So we're going to write the 3, carry the 1. And then 1 plus 5 is 6. 6 plus 2 is 8. So this gives us 83. For the second example, we have 145, I mean 146 rather, and 75. So let's add the first column of numbers. 6 plus 5 is 11. So we have 1. We'll carry over the other 1. And then 1 plus 4 is 5. Plus 7 is 12. So we're going to write the 2. Carry over the 1 here to the third column. 1 plus 1 is 2. So the answer is 221. Now let's try another example. Let's add 1584 with 759. Now the order in which you write the numbers doesn't matter. Your answer will still be the same. So let's begin with the first column of numbers. 4 plus 9 is 13. We're going to write the 3, carry over the 1. 1 plus 8 
that's 9. 9 plus 5 is 14. So we're going to write the 4, carry the 1. 1 plus 5 is 6. 6 plus 7 is 13. So we're going to write the 3, carry over the 1. And then 1 plus 1 is 2. So the answer is 2,343. So that's what you can do to add two large numbers.